so we've got some uh, exciting updates that we've um, we've produced um, for both the coach display app and the solar displays. Um, for the solar displays, with any angle measurement, and the sensors we have for the skiffs are uh, heel, pitch, rudder, and boom angle. So for any of those measured elements then you will get a screen that looks uh, very similar to that. There's no arrow on the pitch screen, that's about the only difference. Uh, but we get four numbers. Uh, at the moment the sensor is just sat on the desk, so it's very stable. You'll perhaps see the number on the bottom left of the screen will bounce around because that's the boat speed and it just is picking up a different GPS signal as it goes from one window to the other. Uh, but um, uh, ignoring that, then the number on the top left is the short term filter. Uh, that can be changed or set in settings uh, on the config page. Uh, at the moment that's set to three seconds. Uh, so it's kind of giving you an idea. The arrow follows uh, the uh, short term filter for the sailors. The number on the top right of the screen at the moment is set for 20 seconds and again can be selected or changed in uh, the, uh, conf on the config page. Uh, the number on the bottom right is the number of degrees per minute that the, um, uh, in this case, the heel is changing. So if the boat is unstable, then that will be a high number. If the boat is very stable, uh, as it is at the moment, uh, because the sensor is just sat on the desk not moving, then that would be a very low number. So if I just uh, uh, move the sensor now to the left and kind of let it sit on the other angle, you see that the number on the top left changes quickly uh, and the travel figures start to increase. The number on the top right will slowly catch up the, um, uh, the number on the top left. And then once it's uh, uh, got through that, then the travel figures will start to reduce finally coming back down to zero again as it picks up the fact that um, it's not moving anymore. Um, so yeah, and then, you know, if I just move that through a, a normal range, if you like around zero, then what we'll see is slowly but surely the, um, the travel figures will uh, start to increase. The uh, number on the top left is representing where the boat is has been on average over the last two or three seconds and the number on the top right again is where it's been over the last uh, 20 seconds or so so if i suddenly start to introduce a little bit more lured heel then i can see my arrow growing so the sailors get to get that short term hit of yes we're now going into more lured heel and uh, i can see my short term filter showing that and my long-term filter is starting to follow now. But now if I manage to get, I'll just try and sit this down on the desk again, not moving anywhere, or more or less, then the short-term filter will show something more like zero. Uh, the travel figures will start to reduce and the longer-term filter will then start to follow as well. So much more information going live into the sailors for them to be able to see whether they are uh, what angles or that, that, that they're achieving for heel, pitch, rudder or boom angle, um, where they are now, where they are overall and what their stability is like. And then finally, of course, how quickly they're going.